Good morning guys, uh, here I am again Captain Christian with a short video this time. Have you ever wondered how the land gear retracts in a Cessna 337? That's the Skymaster that we've been flying in the previous videos. Well, as the airplane itself sits very different from other twins, the landing gear retraction is also different. So that's what I'm about to show you in this short video. Hope you like it. So here we go at uh, runway 27 Riverside, California. All the engine instruments are good. Brief, uh, before takeoff checklist has been complete and we are just ready to go. So let's do it. Release the parking brake. Compass is good. HSI is good. Track is good. Let's do it. Take off. Okay, engine instruments are okay, airspeed is alive, suction is good, electrical is good, everything good, 60 knots, 70 knots, 73, rotate. Okay, brakes, positive climb, gear up. Alright, gear is up, no lights, more than 90, flaps up. Alright, flaps up and prop 2600. Twenty six hundred, there we go, synchro phaser on. And now we are looking to 110 knots for the climb speed. Oh, but wait, you want us to see the gear retraction. So here it is. Okay, let's look back again. Let's take a closer look here. And that's it. That's how the gear retracts on the Cessna 337 Skymaster. Right, hope you enjoyed. You know the drill. Like, subscribe, share with your friends. See you in the next one.